Hey everyone, alright, um, so I was goofing off this morning, playing on my Outlaw Rogue on the PTR, just, you know, goofing, not doing anything special, uh, because I like the Outlaw Rogue, I really do, but it just, you know, had its weaknesses, and one of its major weaknesses was its roll, one of its Roll the Bones procs of Jolly Roger, and being a heal over time, which, when you're a strictly DPS class, I mean, that's what the Rogue is, pokey pokey, stabby stabby DPS, a heal over time like that's not going to be great, you know, it's super great in a raid environment. I mean, I can remember, you know, occasionally using recuperate, uh, you know, heavy AoE damage to kind of give the healers help. But even then, it's like, do I hit them in the face really hard or keep myself alive? And most rogues are going to say, I want to hit them in the face. But anyway, getting back, getting back on my point, uh, I was playing around and I noticed I used roll the bones and I saw Jolly Roger come up. I was like, oh great, well, that's a waste. And I noticed that my pistol shot was proccing all the time. Like, look, there, there it is. What is going on? Well, they made two changes. And how convenient I get those two right off the top. Jolly Roger, now, oh, there it goes. Saber Slash has an additional 40% chance of striking an additional time, which gets you your free saber, saber, uh, pistol shot. Excuse me. Now, Grand Melee... It still increases your attack speed by 40%, but now you get a 10% leech as well. So they took out the heal over time, which everyone hated. I mean, could you imagine you're trying to go into this big burst phase, and just, you're ready, you're ready to get in there, and instead of getting a crit buff or anything like that, you get heal over time. Now you gotta use more combo points to try to get a good buff, you know, like, you know, 40% crit. That's awesome. But that, for me, uh, I would I wouldn't say you know a rogue uh, for me personally would be a main, but definitely something I could goof off on and have some fun. Cause I mean look at this, look at this, look at this. Call in the strike. Oh, it's beautiful. Cannonball barrage. Just just that in itself looks wonderful, and it sounds great. I mean I've played around with the different specs just to kind of just to see, and it's this, just the sound itself is boring. I mean. It sounds like you're poking something with a stick, and yeah, because you, you're stuck using you know daggers. Almost all your abilities require a dagger. And it's boring. It doesn't sound interesting. And I've I've noticed playing this guy that, that well this gal as you can see because night elves look awesome. It's fun. I mean I I get lazy occasionally and I'll you know uh, I'll combo point cap which is you know a scrubbish of me but I'm still having fun. I mean, everything else about this is, is pretty good, but one thing about the, the new Jolly Roger is it, its synergy with Quick Draw, because now you're getting the free pistol shot almost all the time when that thing pops up, and that does more damage, and you get an additional combo point. So you're going to be swimming in points, man. Just just swimming in pointage, and that just means you're going to be hitting harder with more uh, finishers. So hopefully this, this fix will help bring more people back to the Rogue, because you know, Outlaws, it's the exciting new pirate. Arr, it's a pirate. You know, and <laughs> that made my little one laugh. <laughs> uh, you know, being, you know, like this with Cannonball Barrage, you're a pirate captain and you're stuck on an island and you see you need to defend yourself and the, the they're coming in to kill you and you just lift your sword in the air and in comes your, your crew's cannonballs. Oh, it's just beautiful. And of course, don't pay attention to numbers because, yeah, this is a level 80 trading dummy. And then there's the level 60 one. I just like to whack that one. And then, of course, we have the level, boom, 60. <laughs> All right, so uh, new, with this new change, I hope you enjoy it because I am certainly, certainly enjoying the new look um, or the new change to Roll the Bones. It is, sorry. It is definitely, definitely worth looking back into and reconsidering because I think that was its, you know, other than the randomness of Roll the Bones, which personally, I think that fits well with with the, the class fantasy of the pirate. You know, I'm going to gamble or, or, you know, either whether you want to say it's, it's you know, let fate decide or, or gamble on how strong I'm going to be. You know, I think that's wonderful and there's really no bad buff. That you get. Oh, I want to do it again. I want to do it again. <laughs> There's nothing bad you can get. You're always going to get something that benefits you. You know, like uh, finishers reduce the remaining cooldown. That's going to benefit you. You're going to be your cooldown on your finishers is going to come sooner. You know, so you'll be able to do more. Well, you know, you might get. Uh, what's to see? What we get this time. 
you know, attack speed. Now you're just pokey poking and slashy slashy faster. How is that a bad thing? You know, there's really no bad buff. Look at the additional combo point and critical strike. You still win. Now, occasionally you will, and I would love for that to happen while I was jibber jabbering. Occasionally you will get all six. I think goofing off, I've seen that maybe once or. Ooh, there's a threefer right there. Attack speed, uh, cooldown, and additional combo point. My goodness, I'm just going to be swimming. You know, I've, I have seen all. all Six of them? Six of them? Five of them? Whatever. I've seen them all. I lose count. Um, like maybe once or twice. And I did, it was like a one combo point roll. So obviously they only lasted for like, you know, 12 seconds. So, but I mean, you just, you see, if you, if you do it, you know, you do it six, boom. 46 seconds of the bunch of buffs. No other rogue spec does that. And really, I don't think any other spec does that to where... <laughs> To where you're gonna get a random assortment of buffs to just have fun with. It's so cool. Now some people don't like that. They like to have more control over you know where they're where they're generating their combo points and where their stats are. But I think if you're going to play uh, an outlaw rogue and main it, oh I need to fix my crap and uh, and main it, then you're gonna and you're gonna want the randomness. That's gonna be how you play. Um, now, like for me personally, I plan on getting something like uh, "Tell Me When" because I love that add-on. Because this is fine, but I like you know I want to see okay, you know, because you can plan it. Oh, I have more critical strikes, so I need to be focusing on you know maybe getting my bigger finishers going. Or oh, I have the critical strike buff, so maybe now I can get the adrenaline rush going and get hitting harder and faster. So you can you can decide on what you want to do. All right, so uh, go ahead. Get out there and make a pirate. Arr, we'll be pirates together. Arr, arr, arr. All right, catch y'all later.